hello everyone welcome back to our youtube channel and today we have something very great for you we have Tushar from Unstop and he is going to unveil everything about Flipkart Quiz 6.0 so please welcome him so that we can start off with the conversation and get every detail that you will be needing to register for this particular conversation so welcome Tushar thank you then thank you how are you feeling uh, what is the environment around the Flipkart Quiz at your end. So this year we are expecting a huge response. Um, we went live with the competition on 5th of July and within a span of five days we have received one lakh registration and still yeah. the registrations are open till 31st of July. So expecting a good amount of competition this year. So we are going to move forward with multiple questions that our students might have for you. All right. So let's see if we can answer all of the questions and get our students for the week. All right, so first question that we have for this particular Flipkart bit is, uh, this is the sixth phase, right? That's right. Sixth season yeah. of Flipkart. I think that this Flipkart bit 6.0 is going to be more difficult than the previous versions of it. So like I mentioned earlier, of course, um, since we're expecting 2x amount of registration, probably a million students will be participating. Hence, the more the competition and it will be a bit challenging. All right, next is, is Flipkart actively looking to hire and what will be the hiring percentage for the winners and for the participants? Absolutely. So it is um, a hiring challenge. Um, so this year, Flipkart have also revealed it on the website. They're looking to hire 200 plus candidates. And last year also for that matter, they hired more than 200. Um, so every time, whatever they commit, they hire more than that. So certainly there are positions um, and in fact they are offering 32 LPA for SGE role for the full time role and a 1 lakh per month stipend to SGE internship as well. Great, that's a great opportunity for the students. Uh, next up is if they wish to hire or uh, what tracks are they planning to offer? So primarily, uh, so I want to add to it, so primarily uh, they hire for SGE role. But they also have other tech roles, other tech roles like application engineer, information security roles, right? Uh, and um, uh, since we work very closely with them, so even after uh, they're done with SG hiring, they open up a few more roles and they reach out to uh, the students who reach the finale stage or the idea submission stage to enroll in such roles, right? And they, whosoever registers for Flipkart, great. And in fact, uh, this year, uh, whosoever qualifies the first round, right, uh, they will uh, they will get a chance to get enrolled in the Flipkart hiring process. Okay, a very important question that comes from the non-tech or student criteria as well. Does each track require coding or are there any additional subjects? So there's no live coding round, honestly, uh, in the entire format. It's very simple. So there are three rounds in total. First being the MCQ round, wherein the questions will be based on coding fundamentals, algorithmic based, uh, Git based questions, OOP based questions, right? Python based questions, jQuery based questions, machine learning based questions. So certainly you need to have a bit amount of uh, technical knowledge, but live coding per se is not really required. Going forward, is there any particular proficiency that is needed or let's say per se any percentage criteria or something? So all streams, every engineering student whosoever is pursuing any stream is eligible to participate in this contest including the one who are doing masters in engineering, ME or MTech as well. So everyone who is doing BTech or MTech uh, is eligible to participate. Specifically, it's Pan Indian as well. Pan India. So, uh, what is the team size that they are aiming for this particular? Place? So, um, it's it's very student centric. It's up to you. There's a team size of one, two, three. You can either participate individually, form a team with one team member, and also form also you can form a three a uh, team of three potentially. So it's entirely student centric. It's up to the student if they want to participate individually or uh, with someone individually or in a group of two or three. can the same team participate in different tracks or they have to have different teams like what's the situation so there are three tracks in total one is the software development track information security track and robotics track 
and yes you can register for all three tracks as well there's no restriction that you can only apply for one track uh the more you in fact we encourage our students to register in all three tracks right it increases your chances of moving to the idea submission round so we talked about the eligibility as a concrete over here now let's move towards the uh, pattern all right so what is the pattern of the competition so there are three rounds in total the first one being the mcq assessment wherein i mentioned earlier as well so it will be based on computer fundamentals objective based question it will be a 30 minute assessment once you get shortlisted in the mcq assessment round you move to the idea submission round in the idea submission round flipkart will be giving problem statement the real business problem statements which uh, flipkart is facing right now and students have to prepare a solution for it and submit once you get shortlisted in the idea submission round you move to the grand finale round you said the second round is going to be mostly uh, for let's say problem statements which flipkart is providing So, do you think that for uh, this particular round, the students will have to uh, research on Flipkart? What are the activities going inside Flipkart? Do you think that is important? Of course, it is important. But uh, but but not everything is available in public domain. So, the problem statements are defined in such a manner that uh, you can. Come up with solution with technologies, right? So, so these are broader problem statements, right? Not very specific. Suggesting all the students to put on their thinking caps and start evaluating. Is there any limit of tracks that one can register to? No. Uh, so students can re- yeah. register in all three tracks. In fact, we encourage yeah. them to register in all three tracks because it increases their chances. Of getting in, enrolling into Flipkart hiring process. Next is we've already again talked about this. What are the dates of Flipkart grid? Uh, exam date is not in public domain, so uh, the registration deadline is thirty first of July, and uh, the exam date will soon be released. What is the time gap? Do you think after the registration closes? Like, do you think there's a week or two gap when the exam dates are announced? So the assessment will take place right after uh, the registration closure. Probably they'll get. A day's time, not more than that. Okay. Next coming up is uh, what have they decided as the prize money for the winners this time? The total prize pool this time, the cash prize pool is five point two five lakhs, along with PPIs. For our students, uh, it's in very layman language. Can you explain PPIs to them? PPIs full form is pre placement interview opportunity, right? So once you become a winner, um, Flipkart assures you that you will get interview and bases your skill set and knowledge. They will take a call. Uh, you can join their team as a software developer or not. So, thank you for all the information. Uh, just one last question: Can you tell them from where they can register? I also quickly uh, share this link for them. So, as soon as you hop on to unstop. dot com, uh, you will be able to see uh, the banner. So, if you can go to the home page, right? Yeah. So, this, this is the like, page, right? Yeah, and of course, in the Video itself, you can add the URL of this page in the description. Definitely, right. definitely, we'll add the link over here. So you can come here, click on register here, and uh, then you also have all the remaining details that you wish uh, to get right. for this particular set of questions. And on unsub. dot com, if you're not able to find it, just write in the search bar Flipkart Grid. You'll be able to easily find it. Or okay. either on the home page as well, we have the banner running. Flipkart grid. Mm-hmm. So, uh, students, don't worry. We'll attach the registration link in the description box. You can get the link, click there, and get yourself registered for Flipkart grid. We hope that we have answered all your questions. If there's anything more to that, just know you can put your queries in the comments, or you can reach out to us on our uh, mail, mail ID. Uh, everything is linked in the description box. Is there any one motivating tip or guide that you would like to give to all our students? We do this at the end of every video. Honestly. I believe the first round is the deal breaker, which is the MCQ round. And no matter what, um, whatsoever knowledge you already have, you have attained in your let's say initial two years or three years of your engineering, I would recommend start today, start practicing, give as many mock tests as possible for coding fundamentals. That would really help. That's the only thing which will help you sail through, right? And also. I just want to add one more point. So the MCQ assessment test is judged basis accuracy plus speed. The faster you answer, uh, there are the chances of you making it to the second round uh, increase essentially, right? So it's very critical for you to be um, uh, like to look a bit of fundamental concepts to be on tips, 
right? So the more you practice, I guess there are higher chances of you getting shortlisted for the second round. And then the card hiring process, anyways, that's that's a reward to see, right? For everyone. Who's uh, who's uh, who's able to qualify the first round will get into the flip card hiring process. So yeah. coming directly from Tushar, need to be expert as well. So make sure that you guys start preparing, start registering, and if you have any other query, do let us know. We'll be more than happy to help you out. Thank you, Tushar, for joining us.